Hello, my name is William, owner of Regal Empire Dobermans. Regal Empire Dobermans is a veteran operated and owned kennel. Uh, what made me decide to start becoming a breeder was that I grew up with Dobermans as a child. I love the dogs, I love the breed, and now that I'm out of the military and have more time to myself, I just felt like it was something a passion of mine that I wanted to embark on. And uh, luckily I have Law, who is my three-year-old Doberman. He's 117 pounds right now. Um, I love him to death. He's a great member of the family. And um, he's really the, the king of the Regal Empire. So a lot of people wonder why Doberman's ears get cropped. They think it's just for the scary look, but actually it's to help these dogs hear their protection and guard dogs. It helps them hear and it's easier to keep their ears clean. Normally Dobermans are born with big, long, floppy ears, and that's okay to keep them like that. Here at Regal Empire, if our clients decide to get the ears done, we do what's called a standard crop, and we do it a little bit differently. We do it with an insert. So instead of the old school taping and keeping the ears all taped up, ripping the dog's hair off. Our veterinarian puts in two wire implants, stents almost, that hold the ears erect. And after a couple of weeks, they get them taken out. No taping required. Tail docking is another service that we provide here at Regal Empire. A lot of people don't know why tails are actually docked. They think it's just for the look, like with the ears, but it actually does serve a purpose. A dog's tail is easily breakable, um, which can cost a lot of medical expenses, and it can be, you know, obviously very painful for your animal. So we dock our tails uh, with the standard dock at the second digit, and um, we do it very young, you know, before the nerve endings are actually uh, connected. So we do it between three and seven days of the puppies being born. Um, it has a great aesthetic look, as you can see, and the dog is too young to even feel it. So here at Regal Empire, another service that we provide is dew claw removal. Um, a lot of people don't really know why the dew claws are removed, but the dew claw is an extra claw that's on the back of the dog. <laughs> All it really does is serve as something that can cause problems down the road. Uh, it can get snagged, infected, and hurt, and you're spending way more for no reason. So we go ahead and remove that at a young age as well for the Dobermans. Our dogs are our family members. If something tragic was to ever happen to where they were lost or we couldn't find them, it puts us in a very panicked um, situation that we don't like to be in. So here at my kennel, what we do is make sure that we give every dog a microchip with the home again system. Uh, basically, it's a microchip that gets implanted in the back of the dog's neck. It has all your information, your home, uh, your phone number, and all contact information. So if your loved one does end up getting lost, we can find them and you'll be able to bring them back home safely. So before our dogs are allowed to go home, we keep them for eight to nine weeks. In that eight to nine weeks, we will take care of all age appropriate shots for your puppy. We wanna make sure they're healthy, we wanna make sure they're safe and ready to go home so you don't have to worry about all the things that come along with taking them to the vet. We try to take care as much as we can. You will get what's called a puppy passport, which will tell you when the next shots are due and what time to go get them. So we try to handle all that for our clients. When I was a kid, you know, growing up in the late 80s uh, in California, Dobermans were very cool dogs, but everyone was scared of them because they were seen as these vicious, you know, evil, almost, you know, junkyard dogs where you, know, you remember in the movies, all the bad guys would have these dogs. And so, you know, the public opinion on them was out that they're kind of, you know, mean. But we breed our dogs for temperament. Uh, we make sure that they are very stable. They're loving. They love kids. They love other animals. They're great animals overall, and I think we've accomplished that so far with our big guys. Come here, big boy. Hey, we shot. Good boys, real good boys. Training is a critical part of your dog's development. 
Um, puppies are very rambunctious. They have a lot of energy. They're very inquisitive. They want to know what's going on in the new world. We've partnered with a training company called Iron Will Dog Training. And once you get a puppy from Regal Empire, your puppy will be enrolled for one free temperament assessment and one free dog training session on us. Uh, with that training session, you'll know what kind of dog you have. Is your dog very excited? Is he more laid back? We want to handle all those questions for you. So that way, when your dog is ready to become a true member of your family, he's trained up and ready to go. Something we offer here at Regal Empire is what we call our puppy starter kit. We want your dog to go home with something to play with. And we also want your dog to go home with some good nutritious food. So what we do is give you a bag of free dog food and you also get two toys and a teething towel. The toys are gonna to be for the dog to play with and chew on to make the trip home a little more comfortable. And they're also gonna have the mother scent on the toys. We think it keeps the dogs calm, makes them feel a little more comfortable about going to a new facility. Also, the teething towel is gonna to be because puppies like to bite things, they like to chew on things. This will help minimize any damage, hopefully, to furniture or things at your home. You give them a teething towel and it lets them go ahead and do what puppies do, but in a safe way. Once again, my name is William. Thanks for coming down to hear about Regal Empire Dobermans and to meet my big guy, Law. You can feel free to check us out online at www.theregalempire.com or on Instagram at Regal Empire Dobermans. I think it's time to go play. Uh, he's definitely letting me know he's ready to play. Welcome to the Regal Park where all of Regal Empire Dobermans love to play. How's it going? I'm William. This is Law. This is our king at the Regal Empire. He is currently weighing in at 117 pounds. He's very energetic, very loving dog. He's been a pleasure to own. And I think if there was only one negative I could say, he doesn't stop running. Tons of energy, but he keeps me in shape. Uh, here at Regal Empire, we try to make sure we breed our dogs for health, you know, to be great family members, but you don't have to take my word for it. You can speak to some of our satisfied customers. Well, I just got back from Chicago and had a contract up there and I was at a barber shop. And the barbers were talking, Will came in, the barbers were talking about his dog. I said, can I see a picture of his dog? And he found a picture of Law. Lala stood up on his hind legs up to his shoulders. Now, Will is six foot tall. That means I'm a big Doberman, right? He said, well, I got litter just, just kind of ready to go. You are interested? I said, yeah. Went out there that Sunday, uh, 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 less than, uh, I think the next day, and I saw uh, my dog. He was only two months old, a month and a half old. I said, yeah, let me go ahead and do this. So um, it was funny because that day when I saw um, them, that was the day that he uh, made it with uh, Blaze Mom Cotton. So um, I had asked Will about the breeding, and it's when he explained to me they just made it, and they should be uh, probably expecting puppies in the next two months. So um, I told Will that I was uh, possibly transitioning back to Florida, and I was kind of iffy about the time of getting a dog. So. Uh, after Cotton had the puppies, I went over and saw them, and I fell in love with the dogs, and I decided to go ahead and get one. Oh, we absolutely love him. He's, he's well trained. I mean, even though we really hadn't trained him like talking about it, he's very friendly, loves our kids, you know, he wants to run around and play with them all day long, and we just love them. Yeah, best decision in picking out a dog. Yeah.
Regal Empire Dobermans.